All right, hello guys. We are back with uh, the bad guy route. For now, anyway. Yeah. I mean, for all I know, there could be another roadblock, but we could uh, apparently pretty... go to the bad guy hideout now. Yeah, so we should be able to get into Kanjanto Peak and continue it this time. Yeah, and uh, you know, worst case scenario, we're gonna fall back on the good guy playthrough that we've been doing. Uh, I guess as a side note, since we're here, uh, remember how in like the good guy playthrough, since we did the uh, the brigand thing on the bridge, we got an upgrade to the shield? Uh, I think so. Yeah. Yeah. The, the, if you actually took the brigand's bribe, you get something like that too, which is what I have equipped right now. Oh yeah, I see you have like an orange shield. Ooh. Yo, it's um it's the frickin' fire wheels from Ninja Gaiden. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Defense increase, plus it makes these little fire rings that can hurt stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna call it, I'm gonna call it the fire wheel, because that's, you know one of my favorite Ninpo arts. Well, I mean I mean, I've been enjoying, you know, the Ninja Gaiden series, especially after playing their first 3D game. And now, uh, I have to play Ninja Gaiden 2, Ninja Gaiden Sigma 2, and Ninja Gaiden 3 Razor's Edge, which I have on Steam already. Because I bought the <laughs> whole collection when it was, like, kind of new. And, uh, yeah, those are gonna be pretty tough. <laughs> but at least Ninja Gaiden 2 is. I heard 3 is kind of easy. But I can't say for sure. It's like the complete opposite of the NES trilogy, where the third one's actually the hardest one. <laughs> Alright, let's see. All right, we have the password, that's nothing new. Alright, let's find out if it'll accept us. Sir Tankred has called upon mercenaries for aid. They are arriving by boat. Make sure he and his, and his men at arms never meet for each star sub. Make sure those men never touch land. I'll give you a bonus if you manage to sink the boat, too. Are we going where I think we're going? Yeah, we're going back to the shore. Like the very start of the game? I want that fool, fool Father Henry to suffer. Bring me Julius, his young apprentice. Hell yeah, yeah. I think that's what we're doing. Wow. Yeah. Two new quests. Okay, we could actually get something new. <laughs> Hopefully, um... Hopefully there isn't anything else that's gated out of, uh, I'm, the bad I'm ending. Complete, I'm very sure there isn't. <laughs> Alright, well that's good then. Well, let's go kidnap Julius first. Oh, where's he at? I'm pretty sure he's one of the priests that, that's in here. I think he's this guy over here. There he yep. is. <laughs> Why don't we now just what? teleport him? <laughs> Now, what are we going to turn this guy into? The time has come. The preparations are complete. Julius, from your sacrifice we shall gain the power we desire. Hear my call. Rise from the blood. And serve me! It's going to turn into another hell spawn. What shall he become this time? Oh, uh, this guy. But he's red now. He was red at the start, too. <laughs> oh. Jordan, you have done well. Our master is ready to meet you at last. This cathedral is in Coppleton in the cemetery. Go to him and show your devotion. So yeah, I'm pretty sure we can I'm pretty sure we can just continue on words, but let's go ho burn stuff down anyway. Let's go destroy a boat. Yeah, it even says it's the shores on the map. Well and we're fully maxed out, as far as I know, so. Yeah, I mean, look at the XP. <laughs> XP maxed. Oh, I got a, I got, I got a bit of a lag spike there. <laughs> well, it wasn't a lag; it was an like an input delay spike. <laughs> hey, here we go. Oh, hey, <laughs> Jordan, welcome. Let us proceed. <laughs> I love how the cultists look angry every time. They're like, ah, we're cultists. Lord Jordan, you were once a man of honor. I urge you to renounce your heretical ways. Let us throw. <laughs> the <laughs> smile. Oh, and there's one thing you can do. Here, let me, uh, help. Enough! 
That was easy. Jordan, why? I will never forget your betrayal. One day, I will pay back what you were owed for this. Oh, no, not the cultists. Oh, we won. So, uh, I guess let's go get a reward, then we'll head off to the cemetery. Hell yeah. It's a shame there's not really any quicker way to get back there. Yeah. You just gotta dash everywhere you go. Oh, oh, they're, oh they're, they're 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 uh, hostile now. <laughs> well, I guess it makes sense. I mean, we just we just killed their reinforcements and attacked their captain. So. Oh wow, <laughs> that's that's cool. what the guy. That's kind of cool. That's what the that's what the guy in the golden armor was. Oops. Oh, yeah, that, that's one way to get up here. So now the cultists are our friends, and the townspeople are our enemies. Man, I do love me some, uh, genocide routes. Or, I don't know, I guess just... I guess you could call it chaos route. <laughs> you know, all the uh, SMP. Yes. And then I guess, like, it's also kind of SMP in the way that you have, like, sort of a neutral route. Because <laughs> you can do some good things, but you can also do some bad things at the same time. Sure, take take my uh take my friend. Ooh, um my parsec froze. <laughs> oh it did? Yep. That's not good. Let me let me test this out. Um Okay, seem, it seems good now. <laughs> I was worried I was, I was stuck in this room for a second there. <laughs> that could have been very well, bad. I got a reward, so off to the cemetery. Was it just more money? Pretty sure, yeah. Let's uh, say before we do this. Yeah. And just in case something else bad happens. Yeah, screw praying. Who needs that? Um, I don't know what to expect from this boss. If there's a boss here, I don't know. Here we go. Jordan, why is this guy? I have been expecting you. You have done well, thanks in part to your efforts. Great things are now in store for us. All that remains is to show our true power to this land. Are you ready? Yeah. Yes. Very good. Let the conquest commence. All will tremble yes. to see our force. <laughs> Damn, that's a lot of guys. And they're all friendly. The power of the book must be seen to be believed. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> This is it. This is the moment we prepared for. All forces, ready yourself. Charge! Now we're gonna go lay waste to the towns. Oh, cool. Oh. <laughs> yeah, they're no match for us. So I guess this is like the final boss of sorts? Well, we're gonna have to go to the Citadel still, but... Oh. Yeah. Alright, let's uh... Oh, oh, we have to wait for the big guy to destroy stuff. Oh, at least the big guy's on our team. Also, yeah, big enemies out. are still throwing spears at us. Yeah, I'm taking a lot of damage. It's kind of hard to see because all this red blends in together. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, never mind, we're supposed to go in here. Oh, okay. <laughs> There, that's very helpful. Yeah, this area is a little bit less demanding on the eyes. <laughs> I just throw my little friend in there. I mean, he doesn't respawn every screen, so he's not bad. Heal for good measure. <laughs> Won't let you through. Your evil hand's here. 
Nope. <laughs> Not if I have anything to say about oh! it. Okay, I guess we're just gonna throw knives at them. <laughs> Ow, please. And these guys hit hard. Yes, these are very final boss type guys. Come on, throw your throw your axes at me or something. <laughs> or not. <laughs> It's our good old baby Edgar. Jordan, watch out! Brian, look out! Oh, the dude got impaled. Jordan, your evil deeds stop right now. Take this. Um, well, I hate to break it to you, but uh, I have something funny called a shield. Hmm. <laughs> 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 well, yeah, that's just uh, he yeah. counters that. Yeah. Well, because, um, the two-player thing was not, you know, originally in the game, so... Yeah. Kind of kind of nullifies that entire section right there. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna do that. Shit. Oh, I need to heal real quick. There we go. I mean, I got, like, three potions. I'll be fine. the town. <laughs> I will lay down my life if that is the price. I have to stop you. Alright. Oh shit. I forgot I I forgot about the downward stab. <laughs> This guy kind of reminds me of, uh, that one guy on the horse from Ninja Guy and Sigma as well. Where are you just on a burning bridge? <laughs> I'm hey, surprised they haven't died yet. Well, eventually I'm gonna run out of resources. Yeah, but then now I get restocked. <laughs> well, they get restocked if I die. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Well, well there's our first death. <laughs> Yeah, like, look, my magic's refilled. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's pretty, uh, that's pretty easy. Oh, thanks, big guy. Took you long enough. Well, these guys are just, like, civilians, I think. Yeah, they're just some priests for killing. They can't do anything. And if I tank it, I oh, told shit. you that I would pay what you were owed, Jordan. I will show you no mercy, for you have shown my soldiers none. <laughs> Make your peace now, for there will be none waiting for you in hell. Alright, I'm, I'm ready to throw hands. Alright, I'm trying to get out of the way. <laughs> oh, he blocks. Alright, good heal. Yeah, he's kinda hard to dodge, honestly. <laughs> he just comes at you with that spinning that spinning uh spear of his. Yeah, that, that poison damage will take care of him. Oh my god. <laughs> Bro got annihilated at the end. Finish him. <laughs> well, that really was a fatality. Slicer Tankard. Uh, I am the law. Very good, Jordan. You bested Father Henry's greatest champion. Now to deal with the good father. You should have listened to me, you old fool. Bye. Uh, on a related note, 
We can actually get an ending now if we want. Oh. There's multiple here? Eh, uh, yeah. So we can side with him. <laughs> so we so we can either kneel before him or go on by ourselves with us leading instead. Yeah, go full evil, slay him. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I'll get the kneel ending some other time. Onward! Yeah. <laughs> 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 No, Robert, you are not the chosen one. I am. How dare that worm presume to rule over my lord. <laughs> and here's the mystery thing. Oh. The, ne the Necronomicon. <laughs> also, headphone warning. <laughs> it's a screaming book. <laughs> We've done it! Darsaw belongs to us now! All hail Duke Jordan! <laughs> oh, they're, they're just cool with us having killed their, la their leader? Alright. <laughs> we do what we have to for the greater good. Sacrifices must be made. <laughs> this is the true path for him, but not everyone can walk it. Wow, they are surprisingly cool with us killing Robert. <laughs> I mean, hearing what these guys are like, are you surprised? <laughs> Powers of Mion are not to be feared, instead must be bent to our service. I was at the first ritual at Urzon. At night things got a hand bug yet. Yeah. So what can we do with the book now? Hey, at least Jules is still alive. I'm not sure I know any songs you'd like. <laughs> I don't know, evil people music. Why is this place unchanged? <laughs> yeah. These people are a little too chill, despite what happened. <laughs> a little oversight, I suppose. Yeah. I don't think there's gonna be a, another patch for this game. Well, there's like okay, something so game breaking. I guess let's head off to the Citadel. I guess that's just where the final boss is now, or something? Yeah. I mean... It will be different from Belphegor, I can tell you that. That's good. I was worried it would just be, like, the same. <laughs> it won't be. Don't worry. It's kind of one of oh, my yeah, biggest problems when some games have, like, an evil guy ending, but the evil guy ending, like, most of it's the same, but then the final boss is the same for some reason. <laughs> Which is really weird. And the, the, the final boss only has, like, a few lines of dialogue saying, like, oh, you're evil now, I guess? <laughs> The only game that really comes to mind that does that is Neptunia Rebirth 2. <laughs> That's about yeah, it. Yeah, really. we should probably say so we don't have to watch that again. Yeah. Just in case. Cause there's a pretty there's a pretty messed up ending in Neptunia Rebirth 2 where you can kill all of your friends, and then the final boss has like nothing to say to you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's been a while oh, yeah. since I've seen that ending. So yeah, don't worry, this is going to be very different from Belphegor. Oh wow, they're, they're bowing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, two, two, uh, two, two evil guys coming through. Nope. Necronomicon, <laughs> go! Hey look, it's a bigger version of my shield. Okay, bye, Belphegor. <laughs> and you can turn into a bat now, apparently. <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck? It's a shmup now? Yeah, now we're just in hell about to fight another de demon lord. It's probably like loose fur or something, I don't know. <laughs> uh, this is a bat him. Oh. Not quite why I remember the bat and looking like. <laughs> and he does a lot of damage. Alright, um. 
Okay, I guess that spell doesn't work here. Oh, and I can't use, um... I can only use my heals. I can't switch. Oh, my spell is working alright. At least your spells work. But I can't use my knives or nothing. Oh yeah, he does, he does a lot of damage. My potion still works, at least. I think about it, I probably should have restocked on those. Healing's not gonna be an issue. This boss is probably more of an issue if you're trying to go for, like, a no-hit run or something. Yeah, plus we, we do still have our re restock three lives. Yeah. <laughs> the bitrate's probably crying out in pain on YouTube later, <laughs> from how fast the background's moving in this fight. <laughs> He's about to lose all his health. Yeah, that was that was pretty cool. <laughs> He's angry. My eyes. Oh, actually, I just remembered that. Uh, uh, speaking of YouTube, you'll you'll see in a second. <laughs> After their victory against the Batman, Jordan and Jacob were forever changed to look at <laughs> So evil. The lands of Wukel were no longer enough to, enough to slake their thirst for domination. With the power of the book, Jordan would bend all of the world to his will. Damn, that's pretty old. None could, none could oppose his reign. Yeah, that was the ultimate evil playthrough. Wow, <laughs> definitely was evil. <laughs> Well, I'm glad we got to see that. That was definitely worth the wait, because that was pretty damn good. <laughs> I was expecting a shmup at the very end. Uh, yeah. That only took us, like, 20 or so minutes? Yeah, 20, 22 minutes. <laughs> Not counting the uh, time I had to reconnect. Of course they put that shot in the front. <laughs> okay, so... Oh, this one. Yeah. And the path of the team. There's so many paths. Anyways, uh, back, yeah, I... <laughs> back to stranger mode. You know, <laughs> the, the mode yeah. where a stranger is the good guy. Oh boy, I gotta do some crazy platforming now. So yeah, now we gotta go and do our favorite level, number three again. Oh no. <laughs> well, let's see how this goes. Ooh, almost did that too early. Alright, made it, made it without dying, good. This platforming is still pretty fun, though. Whoop, alley-oop, alley-oop. Hey, we did it! Great. I got so used to the bomb gameplay that I kind of forgot I used to have an axe. <laughs> I mean, the bombs and axes do work some way, so... Yeah, but I like- I just like the explosion that it gives. Uh, also on a random note, something I admittedly did not notice when we started this play throughout last time, uh, the stranger does not have potions. Oh. I guess, and, I, guess yeah, gonna, the I guess it's gonna make it a little harder, huh? <laughs> uh, the, button, the button to use it is replaced by the shotgun. I mean, the shotgun is pretty good, though. Yeah. That's gonna be have less healing to work with, though. I mean, to be honest, I barely used all my healing against that final I only used, like, one potion in that final boss. <laughs> I mean, honestly, I was expecting a phase two for a bad end, but I guess he didn't have one. Then again, I'm used to I'm, I'm used to all the bosses having like second phases. Have any of the bosses had a second phase? I don't think they have. I don't think so. <laughs> and I don't I don't expect the the good route final boss to have one either.
Oh yeah, the shotgun is like very funny to use. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I, I guess that makes up for not having a heal. Just having an OP-ass shotgun. I can't, this way. Alright. Oh yeah, and also, um... You probably know that they recently released the, uh... The DS Castlevania games on Steam. Yeah, you can include a remake on the castle, because why not? Okay, that... I was wondering what, like... What, I was wondering what people were hyping out about for like a, a bonus. Yeah, they uh, they threw in a remake of Sonic Castle by the same people who made Castlevania: The Adventure Rebirth. Oh hell yeah! That's, that is pretty cool. Hello there, good sirs. I'm the brewmaster of Arcos. I could use your help. I was bringing my goods to the inn, and my cart's axle broke. Here to lend me a hand? Sure thing, King. Servile, let's help the man. Right away, Lord Stranger. <laughs> or he could Poor die. Poor guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this guy isn't, isn't happy about us stopping the bridge thing. How dare you cast us out? Oh, oh, oh and everyone's pressing to make them go away. I'll make you regret return to Opel. Come and try, you rapscallion. That was easy. That poor man. What madness has gripped these lunatics? <laughs> He's speaking so politely. <laughs> Which is kind of funny. Hey, look, a place that we're not gonna flood this time. I forgot what I wanted to upgrade. Let's see. So I could get, uh. Oh, yeah, I don't have the. Conservatoria, do I? Actually, I you, think I do. You have it, just it's just like level one. Yeah, I haven't upgraded it yet. Um, you could upgrade your potion again. If, never mind. I should get my health upgraded. <laughs> and that's about it. Oops. I think let's just flip it around here for now. Right, yeah. Don't worry, dude, you get to live this time. <laughs> yeah, and this place won't, um, be flooded. I remember this lady again. Hey, like, it's the person we didn't kill her husband. I saw you try to help my husband at the shores of Opel when he transformed. I know you did what you could, but the evil that possessed him is not truly dead. Here it lingers still. Free my husband's soul and protect Opel. We must destroy the demon permanently. Will you aid me? Oh. See Galan, the wizard of Katsuki. He will teach you to cleanse the world of Paimon's evil. So yeah, that's something we can do when we get to Katsuki. Cool. So a new quest. Yeah. So yeah, like the potion guy isn't even here. Dang, rip. I mean, it's not like you're gonna be able to use potions anyway. <laughs> yeah, I know that, that that's the point. Right, there's nothing in here. Armor shop. They could definitely use armor though. And get a weapon upgrade too. Might as well. So, what's the mystery gonna be for this playthrough, I wonder? Same thing. Oh, it is? Yeah, yeah. we're just gonna take the Necronomicon from him. Oh. Except I'm guessing it does something good this time. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna be hopping into hell, hell, hell again, just not to fight a bad end. Oh. Slightly increased damage. What, are we gonna have like angel wings this time or something? Eh, yeah, you'll see. <laughs> Alright. John. Uh, yeah. Oh, hell yeah, you can get the time spell. Uh, do you wanna grind out a bit so we can get the second life or. Um, I'd say we probably don't need to. Like, we haven't been dying as much recently. I know, but consider where we're going to be going. Hmm. I mean, we could always grind in the dungeon. Fair enough, I and guess. And then come back if we can't beat it with this extra life that we have. 
Yeah, it's over this bit again. And this time we're just gonna put the thing down. Yeah, see what happens. <laughs> Turn it, kill it with fire. <laughs> Burn it. Do it. <laughs> Do it. Do it. Do it. Everybody just walks away. It, it's still going. Will it ever die? Hard to say, sir. Okay, look at his face. <laughs> That's a good face. <laughs> oh, there it is. Another place to talk to people. My young friend Wilfred was stuck on the goal. He's a terrible lord. He was supposed to be back long ago, and I'm begging you, beginning to worry. I have to stay on guard here. Do you think you can go to look for him? Yes. I knew the good Duke and Stranger would and look turn down a loyal servant in me. Good Duke Stranger. Sir, my men are bringing me tidings of strange folk gathered near the old ruins nearby. In the ruins, there is a door. But it is guarded. You need a password to enter. You try and gain access and see what transpires within the Lord. We were able to coax some information from a woman in the village. She claimed to have seen a handsome man leave the hideout and head towards Darsov. Yeah, we're gonna set up Dr. Hans again. Oh great, our favorite character. Is he still gonna die? <laughs> uh I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Er Oh, hold on, but before we do it, let's go save real quick. So, uh, you remember the creepy guy that told us to go destroy the dam? Um, I think so. Let's go give him a little chat, but just outright refuse to, uh, just to do what he wants. Oh, this guy. <laughs> no, never. <laughs> well, then. Perish. And he turns into a demon. I mean, it, like, kind of splits up a bit. Suddenly a new boss. There we go. Kill the specters. Guess it was a ghost in disguise. Ooh. We don't have the teleport spell yet, so do you, you want to walk all the way back to Darsov right now, or? Um. I mean, isn't the is the dungeon closer? Uh. Hey, I don't know. I'm kind of in the mood to do the dungeon. <laughs> oh, actually, actually, no, you know, now that I think about it, it might be better to go back to Darsov, because by the time we get back here, we'll be able to buy the extra life. Maybe, yeah. Probably, I mean, should be enough moon need. Perfect shot. I'm just gonna keep my shield out. Yeah, look at all this killing I can do. lot of cash. One thing I was kind of worried about with the um, Castlevania DS collection is how would they handle the touch controls? <laughs> apparently from what I read, um, apparently you just push like, push like a button combination now instead of like touching the screen. Which is kind okay. of interesting. Because I played a, I played Dawn of Sorrow on DS emulator, and you know I had to deal with like, you know, dragging across the screen really quickly. And um, 
even though it, it was kind of frustrating at times, I couldn't imagine not playing the game, like, with that. So just putting, like, just inputting a button combination seems kind of lame compared to just touching the screen and dragging, like, a, like a shape. I had to do something, I suppose. Yeah, although apparently on the Switch version, you can actually use the touch screen for it, which is cool. But, obviously I don't play in handheld mode, so I won't really get to use that. <laughs> Yeah, the Switch may be technically a handheld system as well, but I don't think I see people actually use it that way very often. Yeah, unless once people are like going out or something. Probably because it's a lot pretty big for a handheld in any capacity. Well, definitely bigger than a 3DS, that's for sure. I mean, I barely, I barely use my Switch in handheld these days. Usually it's just if I'm too lazy to dock it. <laughs> Not because I actually want to play it on handheld. That's also kind of why I just don't really see the point of the Steam Deck. Because, like, I can't record off the Steam Deck. And all it's going to be good for is if I wanted to play Steam games on the go or something. That's pretty much the only uh, reason I could ever see someone wanting to get it. Otherwise, I'd random. I'd rather just, you know, play at, at my own computer. Yeah, looks like we will have enough. Hell yeah. I know a few people that have Steam decks, though, but the fact they're also expensive is another, another like, good reason not to get one. They're like at least as much as a Switch, I know that. But I think the problem with it is, you know, you're paying for something that you could already, um, you know, play your games on. Because you already have a computer if you're buying a Steam Deck. Probably, anyway. So you're, wa you're basically paying like 300 bucks just to get, like, you know, a thing to play Steam games horribly. <laughs> Which doesn't seem all that worth it, in my opinion. Oh. oh. They're bullying him. That'll teach you to keep your trap shut, you blathering fool! Please stop! Oh god! Oh my god. You stay out of this. You don't want any trouble. You knew the price of bailing us, we'll extract it from your hide. Talking to the Duke like that? I hope your affairs are in order. Bam, bam. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you, Lord Stranger. You saved my life. Oh, hey, Servile. Hans, I know you were inside the Toan Passage hideout. I need you to help me. If I tell you the password, they'll simply kill me. I won't let that happen. It was right, Hans. All right. The password is Book of Truth. Please don't let them know that it was me who talked. Huh. Hans, yeah, Hans I guess, guess he'll live this time. Yeah. I guess he's a good dude after all. At least we're convincing him to be. <laughs> yeah. Be a good guy, Hans. Where are we off to? Uh, but I just wanted to see if I could get any upgrade real quick. Oh, okay. Okay, I still can't. Dang, can I get anything good? Uh, I could get another potion, I suppose. You get anything right now. And now I'm broke again. <laughs> but hey, I mean, four potions is pretty good. I mean, I'm definitely not going to be dying anytime soon now. Especially because I have basically the same amount of health as you. Oh uh, yeah, we could also go do the werewolf thing right now. Actually, mm. wait. I mean, that's right, closer. Never mind. Actually, wait, can we, or did we need the up upwards jump thing to get to it last time? I forget. I think we did. Well, I mean, the upwards the upwards strike gives you like a shortcut, so it's it's probably just better to come back with it. Yeah, 
almost at 500. There we go. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess I'm a kind of funny little thing. Uh, uh, you know, uh, a bad in Symphony of the Night? Um, which boss is that? It's been a while since I played Symphony. He's the giant corpse that spawns bugs out of it. Um, honestly, I can't remember. <laughs> well, uh, I guess I'll just speak anyway. Uh, some of the bugs that he summons are basically just versions of himself from the Dictionary Inferno. That's, that's kind of cool. Actually, wait, did we ever do this in here? Okay, we haven't, so I guess let's deal with Mammon real quick. Uh, I guess I'll show you a picture of it after we're done here. Alright. I'm done here. Clear the basement. <laughs> Thank you, Snake. <laughs> yeah, especially because I beat Metal Gear Solid 2 last night. One way to do this fight. And apparently I can absorb the blocks, whatever sense that makes. Oh fuck, the, the splash damage hurts me. Oops, I'm that wrong. <laughs> it's so stupid. It's kinda funny you're able to do the boss like this. Yep. <laughs> now we found a second way to cheese this boss. <laughs> Cleared the basement again. Actually, well, let me look at something real quick. Under the stairs. We got quite a decent amount of um, quests. Another jet. <laughs> I think I'm supposed to be like a uh, badge from Evil Dead now. <laughs> oh, I'm not too familiar with that. Me neither. I think I just like seeing pictures of that guy uh, with just like a blue leather jacket or something. Well, <laughs> now it's not an AVGN reference anymore. Oh yeah, there's the downward strike. Yeah, I wonder how this looks with me actually. I don't think I can do it. I think only you can do it. <laughs> just double tap down. Oh, I, I, that's why it wasn't working. <laughs> Can my bombs destroy these blocks? Oh good, they can. I mean, it's, it's cool, but it's kind of slow. It kind of reminds me of, um, an Abili and Ari of Sorrow. It's kind of similar to that. I find it funny how in I think I, th I forget it, I forget if it was either Ari of Sorrow or Dawn of Sorrow, but there's actually like one completely optional ability, and it's like the ability to like do a slide kick or something. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's kind of funny. And I remember I remember actually getting it, even though it's like you know like a really rare drop from like a random like like skeleton that knows like fighting arts. Man, I love Dawn. I mean, I love Dawn of Sorrow. Kind of wondering how Portrait of Ruins is gonna go. Yeah, it's the only one of the DS games that I haven't played yet. Oh, well, I guess I'll let you know if it's any good. <laughs> and then, and then the year after this year, I'm gonna play Order of Ecclesia, and I'll see how that is too. I really like it well enough. Okay. So I guess uh, uh, after that I'll do like a ranking or something, because then I'll have played all uh, the Metroidvanias. One thing I will mention ahead of time about it is that uh, you're, you're, the 
way you attack is dependent on your magic. Oh, that's interesting. Actually, let's hurry up. I'm probably about to die. I mean, like, uh, all your attacks are glyphs, which may use up your magic. That sounds cool. Your magic does regenerate at a quick rate, at least, which is good. Yeah, it's better than most of the games, where it takes like a, like almost 30 seconds to recharge everything. It does mean there is going to be pausing between your attacks with for no particular reason, though. Oh. That I might have to get used to. Also, uh, well, it's technically a Metroidvania still. It's a lot more uh, level-based. Interesting. And it's funny, because that was like one of the last, like, really big Castlevania games they did, or like mainline Castlevania, I guess. Because after that, they had the weird Judgment spin-off on Wii, and then like, the Lords of Shadow games, which are kind of their own thing. Oh, you can finally upgrade. And I can also upgrade something. Um, let's get my... <laughs> I could max out my shield. Yeah, oh, yeah. Upgrade has been maxed. So now I can just worry about upgrading everything else. So now my shield is the strongest in the galaxy. Well, and after, um... After I finish, uh... Order of Ecclesia. I'm gonna have to figure out like which Castlevania I'd rather play next because I was thinking either I could do like you know Rondo of Blood or I could do one of the 3D ones like Lament of Innocence. That I'm not sure about yet. If you didn't try out the, the 64 games, if you feel like it, <laughs> aren't those ones like not as good? <laughs> I haven't really heard much good about them, or mainly Castlevania 64. Might be worth a try though still. I remember, though I do remember people complimenting the second one, with whose name I forget. Yeah, I forgot what that one's called. I just know it's the one with Cornell, the werewolf guy in it. Oh. Yeah, they, they think we're on their side this time. Lord Stranger. Yeah, so now I just gotta go report back to the guards. Since now we know what their plans are. Haha. -ha. Man, I'm taking way too many hits. Alright, whatever, just go, just go on without me. <laughs> um, we're gonna get our extra life back. And get an extra extra life. And rip all of our money. Yeah, I, mean, I actually still have quite a lot of Castlevania games to play. <laughs> like, I think it's gonna be at least another, like, five years before I play all of them. <laughs> so I only play, like, one Castlevania a year anyway. Fine, Wilfred. Uh, give me a sec, I'm gonna look up what this is about. Alright. You figured out what to do? Uh, yeah, apparently the guy's just up in, in the area up ahead. So apparently we need a potion to heal him? Oh, weird. Gonna be a bit. That's gonna be a bit challenging, considering we don't have a potion slot. <laughs> Second. Okay. I mean, we can at least get the dungeon finished. That's something yeah. to do. <laughs> I 
Since at least I know that's something we can do right now. Yeah, the mermen are gonna suck. Oh god. Or the deep ones, but you know what I mean. Oh, well, that's gonna be fun. I mean, thankfully we have some experience now, so it won't be as bad this time around. Hopefully. Yeah, here he is. Alas, a creature that doesn't want a piece of my flesh that I was done for would stab me while on patrol. I caught a glimpse of a bearded man crimson as he fled. Oh! Uh, never mind. <laughs> oh, I guess he's fine now. <laughs> yeah. I guess since we don't have potions, the game just auto heals him so we don't get soft locked there. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, because Strange doesn't need potions. He's a Chad. Another good use of that shotgun. I think there's a good chance we'll get this uh, series finished up by the end of September. I mean, are we in October? Oh, never mind. I'm an idiot. And we did. We got more moon <laughs> Apparently that guy. Oh. Uh, William was planning on naming my, his firstborn after me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so he'll just be calling his son Stranger, too. <laughs> Not a very wise name. Oh. Well, I guess that's the guy who snapped him. Damn, okay. Fill up that filthy mongrel and tried to return to finish the job. A drunk and an attempted murder? Seems like the world's gone to hell. Uh, yeah. <laughs> All right, then. Uh, fuck, we go. What the hell was the point of that? <laughs> Just a little scene. Okay, cool. <laughs> I guess let's save before we head on. Yep. I've mostly just been trying to play, like, really short games, and try uh, to beat them. You know what I just realized? What? Uh, we didn't get the ultimate weapons on the evil playthrough. Oh, we didn't? <laughs> <laughs> I, I remember how we were supposed to do that, we just, uh, forgot to. Well, since I don't really see much of a point in returning to it, what, what were we supposed to do? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's, it's the same way either way, I'm pretty sure, but... Like, uh, in the hot... In the cultist hideout at the cobblestone cemetery, there's supposed to be an extra dungeon hidden in the uh, in the hideout. Oh, was it the one we did on the uh, the other playthrough? Oh, uh, no, you're thinking of a different one. That's where we got the ultimate armor. Oh, so we just missed an, an, an optional dungeon then? Yeah, don't worry. We're we're gonna head back there during the this playthrough anyway. So, so we'll get to see it. That's good. See that fire? It's coming in handy. Honestly, it probably would have been a good idea if we did get that, because... Man, some of those uh, knights were tanky. Hmm, I see now. <laughs> I see why they took a while to die. Can we do anything over here, or...? This is where we, uh, like, flooded the village last time. Uh, he, he, he just gives a free heal now. And that's still nice. Yeah, since uh, since Persona 3 Reloads DLC is coming out like really soon, I'm just kind of playing like really short games so that I don't like start anything big before I play that. I mean, the answer won't probably won't be very long either. Yeah, it'll still probably take me like. 20-ish hours, I want to say. I don't know how long the answer actually is. 
I wouldn't say it's that long since it's mostly just combat anyway. And P3 being P3, you're not really going to be doing that very much anyway. <laughs> I'm still excited for it though, because I've never actually played the answer. Oh, you haven't? No, I never got to. I mean, I, I could have, because I had FES. I just chose never to do it because I was so, like, content with the ending. I was just ready to move on to Persona 4. That, like, any, you know, extra content, I just didn't really care about. You'll probably like it. I mean, I wouldn't say the gameplay side of it was very good in Fez, but... Oh, I mean, that's... I mean, it's because it's FES. <laughs> Still, you can only really go up in the hair. I mean, just that. Oh god. We'll, we'll see what happens. Yeah, these guys are going to suck. <laughs> I mean, I'm just pretty excited because, like, oh, that's not a good start to this dungeon. <laughs> should, I, should we leave it? Probably, yeah. <laughs> Okay, what ha actually, I got a good question. What happens if I go in here? Oh. <laughs> That's really dumb. I mean, here's an idea. Why don't we see if we can get the uh, upgrade? Uh, okay, maybe not. <laughs> I changed my mind. Yeah, we're off to a bad start. <laughs> yeah, def especially if I die again. This is gonna be a rough one. We'll see. We'll see how long this takes us. Hopefully not that long. I'm trying to think about what weapon I should use. Maybe the dagger? I don't know. I forget, did I have the um did I have the arrows or the daggers for this dungeon? I don't remember. I think we got the cultist thing after we were done with here. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I'll take a drink already. <laughs> I'll just throw my little friend down there. I got <laughs> Uh, down here? Yeah, pretty sure the upgrade was this way. Oh yeah, what am I doing? I can just do this. Die, skeleton, you don't belong in this world. Man, these damn, these damn eyeballs, bro. It's like it's still one hunt shot the um, but... Yeah, that's good at least. The problem is the the swings don't look more delayed than the mace, so. Hmm. Also, I don't think I since I don't think I did this dungeon with the bombs. It's kind of awkward, actually. <laughs> yeah, the Alpheal Servitor is kind of good. I should probably be. I should probably use it more, honestly. Okay. We don't Forgot have the key. Door. Another death. This is gonna be a struggle. Oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, it's probably. I think after uh, replaying this, this is my least favorite dungeon now. <laughs> Just gonna, gonna ignore all that. Me, bro. You can have to get out of here on your own now. Okay, I guess I'll just leave the dungeon then. If I can make it back out alive, that is. <laughs> the amount well, of these eyes are gonna be annoying. Bro, I was drinking! <laughs> He literally killed me in the middle of me drinking. <laughs> yeah.
Okay, at least we know which way to go this time. Alright, kill these damn eyeballs. There we go. Oh, it happened again. The same- the same thing happened again. being this annoying last time, actually. Yeah, health doesn't mean anything if, uh, you know, falling into the water just gives you an insta-kill. Oh yeah, see, I think I know why this dungeon's harder this time around. Because I used to, like, instantly kill them with the arrows, but I can't do that anymore. That's what made this dungeon so, like, manageable on the first playthrough. But, ironically, not having that actually makes it harder. Maybe I should upgrade the Oculus Server for oh, Alright, well, last life then. Use your spell or something. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Okay, back to the entrance. Yep, <laughs> rip our lives. Yeah, this is gonna take a few tries, I can tell that. Yeah, bro's trying to. Right, bro, was trying to knock me into the water again. Alright, I'm just gonna... Try and make a break for it. Dead. Right. Potion, definitely potion. <laughs> definitely. Yeah, just try and make a run for it. Out of the way, bro. Okay, this is really annoying. <laughs> that, that eye being in the way is really obnoxious. There's so many eyes. Yeah, because it, it thinks I'm playing uh, two player still. I mean, you are it's for all intents and purposes. Yeah, look at it. There's like seven of them. Damn. Okay, you can upgrade again. Alright, let's see what it's worth. I kinda wanna upgrade you. Actually, uh, do you mind if we you grind for a little bit so I can get another point in magic? That way I can cast the lightning twice. Sure. We're probably Makes going sense. to need to um come back out here again anyways. Yeah, but uh, never mind. Let's just keep going. Yeah, we're gonna come back out here once we get the upgrade, anyway. <laughs> Shit, happened again. <laughs> yeah, I'm just, I'm just making a break for it, like literally. <laughs> yeah, the way I bowl. Hmm. I really need Feel to remember that exists. Alright, let's get the shield out. And you're dead. <laughs> was a close one. <laughs> I 
yeah, definitely go top route every time. I can't think of a reason you'd want to go on the bottom route. <laughs> Considering how dangerous it is. Alright, this time we actually unlock this door. There we go, that's going well so far. Good. Very good. Alright. I think we're getting closer. At least the shields help I got in this dungeon. Hang on, I got I got an idea. <laughs> Let's do that. <laughs> Okay, time to make a run for it. <laughs> I'll use my drinks if I have to. Okay. Definitely use the drink now. Oh, there's so Jesus. many of them. <laughs> I don't really need the experience that bad anyway. <laughs> Spike Shuffle. Oh boy. Okay, we got we got extra life left. We're okay. Your daggers don't one shot them. Dang, that really sucks. <laughs> The daggers are more of a boss thing now than an enemy thing, like they used to be. To be fair, my daggers, have, I haven't really upgraded them that much yet, so that could also be a ride they're not as good. Actually, watch your look. Can't, can't you look at their upgrades from here? Um, the, tool, the tools bit. Yeah, you can. It just says poison damage is dealt to enemies at faster rate. Gain extra and then this one just gives you, um, let's see. And this this one keeps increasing the damage. Okay. Yeah, and it increases your daggers. Yeah, so one extra dagger and more damage, basically. Poison damage, specifically. Yeah. I'm going to ignore you guys. Keep underestimating where they're gonna go. Oh boy. <laughs> well, I mean, these are our last lives, so hopefully, hopefully we uh, don't get absolutely sniped by them. Oh my god. Holy shit. Aw, oh, shit. Alright, just keep going. <laughs> there doesn't seem to be any guys here. Okay. Now you just have to get out of here. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Thank God for the upward strike, though. I mean, I don't imagine it's gonna be that hard to get out. Especially with that shotgun. But we'll see, I guess. You do have an extra heal if necessary as well. Yeah, one. One heal. <laughs>
It's not looking so good so far. <laughs> yeah. Well, got a lag spike there for a second. Yeah, screw your axes. Really, these guys are really hard to fight. <laughs> this is what playing an NES Castlevania game feels like. <laughs> limited, limited options and attacking. We do that. And more funny eyeballs to get rid of. Damn, my parsec lagging big time right now. We should probably just do this dungeon and call it a day then. <laughs> yeah, this dungeon does suck. Alright. Low and steady. Yeah, I guess that's the I guess that's the only way we really can do it at this point. Gonna dip past you guys. If we stay in sync, it'll also help. For a little bit. <laughs> I'll destroy those guys. Okay, that that definitely helps. <laughs> After doing a second playthrough of this, I think this is probably the hardest dungeon in the game now. <laughs> like, I don't think anything compares to this. <laughs> Based on two-player mode, with all, all the eyeball, all merman, and just instant death everywhere. Yeah. Ah, oh, crap. So, we're doing okay so far. We haven't lost a life yet. Yeah, it's better than the last playthrough. My parse that keeps lagging the fuck out for some reason. Hopefully that won't get me killed. <laughs> I'm not gonna start bitching about it until uh, I actually die from it. <laughs> I'm just gonna throw you.
that cave. Alright. Run now. for it! I'm just gonna run. I'm, I'll damage boost if I have to. Only got hit right at the end there. Alright, good. Why are there so many of them? <laughs> hit. Oh, I almost died. <laughs> Yeah, I hear eyeballs. So yeah, we haven't died yet. Well, Somehow. we're basically saving our lives for, um... We're basically saving our lives for the platforming section at the end. Oh, nice. And I have a full shield charged up. Having a uh, having the shield definitely helps with two player mode. <laughs> Man, you ruined you ruined it. Damn it, eyeballs. Okay. I'm just gonna run past then. Yeah, that's one life. Okay, not bad. Wait, I have, we can I, do this. Actually, I have an idea. What if I do? What if I do? Um, this. <laughs> That kind of helps. Oh, rip. The knockback got me. And this one has no mermen, so we're good. We can actually get back this time. Thankfully. Hope so. Full health, full potions. Should be good. Hopefully things will be much more smooth sailing after this. I mean, the dungeon is pretty much over once you get this. Do you want to try and go for Leviathan at this point? Mm, I'd rather not risk it. This dungeon's painful enough. <laughs> uh, well, let's not come back down. Oh, oops. I'm not supposed to go up here. <laughs> yeah, that's the one with like the swarming merman room. So let's oh, not the, do that the, again. Oh, that's the long way. I forgot. So, uh, do you want to try and go for Leviathan? I mean, how much longer is this dungeon before Leviathan, anyway? I don't think there's much left. I mean, if that's the case, we could try it, because we have full health and full potions. And I, I still have a heal left. Yeah. Oh, well, I guess let's be ballsy. I mean, it would save having to backtrack through the dungeon, at least. Unless, like, something really bad happens. Like, one of us falls into a pit or something on the way there. Hopefully not. Let's go. Oh, that's the wrong way again. Oh uh, yeah, right here. Yeah, okay, here. Ooh. <laughs> Damn, okay. Oops. Okay, maybe we should go back then. <laughs> Unless you want to try and solo it. <laughs> Leviathan isn't that hard, so... maybe? I mean, you're right there. Okay, let's be ballsy. Yep. <laughs> Please don't regret this. <laughs> oh, that's so weird. I'm so used to seeing, like, two players here.
Oh, it's gonna be a lot harder than I thought. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's very it's very awkward. I guess the shotgun can work. As long as you don't push yourself off the edge. The bosses are much harder when in not in the context of two-player. This boss isn't that hard, especially since it doesn't have that many attacks. Yeah, probably is me being stupid and it being part of a little hard to attack him. Yeah. Damn, he burned your ass. <laughs> now we gotta do that shit again. Well. Okay, lesson learned. Definitely head back this time. <laughs> well, head back if we if one of us dies, I guess. <laughs> Parsec froze again. The fuck is happening? I think I think your internet's dying or something. <laughs> well, you're kind of stuck there now. <laughs> Speaking of dying. Yeah, your internet your internet shit itself. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, I mean, might as well just reset then at that point. <laughs> well, you have slightly more experience now, I guess. Yeah. It's, uh, Infernax Lag Edition today. <laughs> Frickin' eyeballs. Oh boy. <laughs> This is what it feels like to play on PS Now. <laughs> Great. You're getting closer to upgrading your magic, at least. Actually, you might, we might as well grind now. Isn't it 5,000 for the next magic? Yeah. So I guess we can grind now, since you're so close. Like, it's like that time we grinded in that other dungeon. Alright, just one more eyeball. There we go. There we go. And definitely save now. <laughs> Five experience. Yeah, slow and steady. At least trying to, anyway. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be working out very well for me. But we got lots of heals, we'll be okay. Uh, 
And as long as the game doesn't lag at a bad time, uh, it'll be good. <laughs> So I remember back in the day, um, I remember playing on PS Now, and I pl I tried playing Mega Man 9 on there. But since you're playing, uh, since you're playing the game over, you know, a cl over a cloud, it lags really bad. So, like, you could be, like, doing some crazy platforming, and then the game will just lag at a really bad time, and then you'll die. <laughs> and that's what this is reminding yeah, me of. That, that, that just reminds me of uh, playing... Uh, Super Mario Land 2 on the Super Game Boy. What's wrong with that? <laughs> uh, so you know like the Super Game Boy you can draw on the screen? Yeah. Well, if you hit, hit the button to clear the screen, it causes the, the screen to buffer. Well, that's weird. <laughs> I've never heard of so that. For, and for, here's the thing, the game itself is still playing like normal, it just won't visually look like that. So, for example, if, one, if your cheeky little brother decided to spam the button, well, it can make the game part line impossible to play. <laughs> so, so you have a lag the game button then? Uh, more or less. <laughs> Even if it won't visually, it only look like that visually. What the fuck? Game up, well, otherwise, I just gotta get over here. Uh, I smacked him over there with the bat. <laughs> yeah, and then he came over to me and was like, "Hey, what's up?" <laughs> There you go, die eyeballs, you don't belong in this world. There we go. And the merman's dead too, even better. Yeah, wait, wait, I'm dead. Oh yeah, I forgot, just run. Yeah, I just wanted to get rid of that swarm over me. Oh, fuck off. This is really bad. Okay. Yeah, I really hope your internet doesn't shit itself next time we play. <laughs> I hope not. Yeah, I don't know what's causing it to act up today, anyway. Yeah, shield out now. There, never mind then. Uh, is it still going crazy? Why are you not moving? Yeah, whenever I, whenever I'm, whenever I stop moving, the game just starts lagging. <laughs> Like, it, it, it ends up being okay for, like, a minute, and then, like, it'll have, like, you know, like, 10 seconds of, like, lag. <laughs> Guess we haven't died yet. Yeah, but I might end up dying if it lags over a pit. <laughs> Alright, let me heal. Actually, you can use the spell again, I think. Or uh, no, I'm out. Oh, okay. Need one more upgrade before I can do that. I see. <laughs> Ooh. Damn it! That was a close one. Hey, at least you made it over, though. Yeah, plus I was one hit away from death anyway. Alright, I'll take it. Damn merman, man, I'm telling you. <laughs> well, this room's free. Well, that doesn't even hit me. Yeah, we're both alive, and we still have an extra life. Yeah, I, I feel <laughs> more confident to take down Leviathan with that. Yeah, why, why not? <laughs> Watch us somehow, just somehow screw this up again. <laughs> Half the episode is just gonna be this dungeon because the dungeon sucks. <laughs> I 
I gotta stay in sync. I'm amazed I'm able to do that consistently. Shit. You might want to heal yourself there. There we go. Take a drink! And, uh, I'll throw the Servitor up there, why not? Yeah, I've gotten the hang. Oh wait, right. Don't go up there. <laughs> okay, I remembered. Had to be ballsy again. Hopefully without regretting it. Yep. Ballsy's basics. <laughs> yeah, I'll just tank the hit. I don't really care. Anyway, there's no merman in this room. Yeah, just, just weapons of mass destruction. And it, boss time. It. I'll Wait. heal us up here real quick. Huh, it's a good thing you can heal though. Oh, they spawned my guy. <laughs> Oh yeah, I, I can't afford to just shoot the guy from... Oh, that does not count as projectile. Shit. Well, that, there's our- there's a good use of our extra life. So I was only on like one potion anyways, I think. Shield. I'm gonna heal to be safe. Yeah, he, he's basically dead. There we go. <laughs> Thankfully, we never have to do that again. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm ready to call it a day after that. Yeah. Actually, why don't we head back and get the teleport spell first? Okay, we can do that too. Yeah, yeah that's okay with you. Yeah, I kind of want to get it done anyways. <laughs> and I think we can... Isn't there like a quest we can trade in as well? I forget. Uh, not at the moment, no. Okay. That'll be for later, then. Oh, uh, yeah, you can also upgrade. Oh. I'll do that, too. Ah, almost 5,000. That's crazy. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't register my down input. Yeah, we're gonna pray twice. Alright, um... Yeah, I mean, I could get another potion if I wanted to. I'll make the, the servitor better. Okay, that the sound just broke. Yeah, what was that? No fanfare for you. <laughs> so now he's way stronger. <laughs> okay, bit too much, bit too much end lag there. Damn. Now we can get up out of here. We can wake up, get up, get out there. <laughs> Jesus. We are idiots. Jesus. We are idiots. Yeah, that wasn't the that was the lie that time. That was just being dumb. <laughs> Thank God it's not a very far walk. Yeah, I just I want I want to get out of here anyway. This place sucks. Mm 
That pile of meat's just gonna be there all game now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, let's go get that teleport spell real quick. Hell yeah. Cause I love teleporting. I can't go a single day without it now. Dang, I like fast travel in any game though. It's a pain when you don't have fast travel at all times. It's not even that expensive either. Thankfully. <laughs> now you're gonna be like, you need 2,000 gold for the flight spell. <laughs> <laughs> we'll teleport to where we're gonna go next episode. Yeah, next time we'll be heading off Catsky again. Great. <laughs> and hopefully Parsec doesn't shit the bed again. <laughs> yeah. Yep. I think that's a good note to end the episode on. Because we also got, um, the bad guy route playthrough done as well. So, Ooh. we got some progress. I mean, we only did one dungeon, but... We'll do the other two next time, as long as, uh, it's, you know, f smooth enough. <laughs> but, alright, I'm gonna go now. I'll, uh, I'll see you next week, probably, man. And, yep. uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do more of this game. Hope y'all enjoyed watching. Yep, alright, I'll see you, man. Yep. Alright, let me just get off his parsec real quick. <laughs> alright, well, anyways, guys, thanks for watching uh, Infernax for today. Um, I would have gone, like, slightly longer if, uh, Parsec wasn't killing itself, but, uh, it's probably his internet, you know, it's, it happens. But anyways, uh, make sure to like and subscribe on YouTube and Twitch, as always, and, um, later tonight, we might do some PVZ. See you then.